Hello and welcome back. We're doing an island video where every island gets a trait, but we're doing it with the new traits included. If you don't know, the last update that came out added like, I don't know, 10 more traits or so. And some of them are pretty wacky if you ask me. Pretty wacky indeed. So let's jump to it. I have in front of me 100 islands. I don't think we're gonna be filling up all of them, so I'll probably remove a few, but give me about an hour. I'll be back with all these filled out with all the appropriate people and traits and names. I gotta name them too. If I may ask you to like the video now, because this is gonna take me so much time. And I've done this so many times. So, um, one eternity later. Okay, we've done it. We've finally done it. Here we go. We've got populations of 10 on all the traits on all the islands. Now we just get to sit back and relax and wait for this corner over here to absolutely explode. We have Death Bomb, Death Nuke, Energized, Mega Heartbeat, and Whirlwind all in the same general area. Some of them aren't gonna last very long, Whirlwind being the number one. That's gonna go quick. When either of the Death Bomb and Death Nuke people go, this whole area is gonna get lit up pretty bad, but I think they'll survive. Death Bomb will just explode its own island. Kingdom Burning Feet destroyed. Oh my gosh, there they go, already. I don't know how they already suffered a death, but you know what? I've learned to not ask questions in this game, I tell you what. That actually did a lot more damage than I expected um, to the side island, so Dragon Slayer's down to four. And Energized, they're still at seven, they're chilling. Mega Heartbeat over here, I feel like they're gonna have a weird experience getting started. I don't think that they're gonna last very long. Pyromaniac, kinda same deal. Super health. They've got crazy amounts of health, but we didn't intervene and give them anything to heal. So they have to heal by like eating and stuff. So uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, yeah, Burning Feet is gone already, of course. Any other ones that are gonna go quickly? Infertile, they can't have any kids, so they are gonna be at 10 forever until they either get taken over or die of old age or starvation or something. Whatever happens first. We got Acid Blood, Acid Proof, kind of some silly ones up here that aren't going to do much. Short Sighted is destroyed. By a wolf? Did you kill all 10 of them? Okay, they got killed by a wolf. Let's go ahead and turn on Peaceful Monsters, because I don't really want that to be part of the equation. Uh, the random chance a wolf spawns on your island and kills everyone. Sorry to uh, Short Sighted there, that wasn't very nice. Ah, what the heck. We'll put them back in. We are leaving the ages on. I don't think that's going to affect very much, but it looks like Age of Wonder is up next. So, I mean, you know, if it happens, it happens. If they don't make it that far, that's okay too. It's usually a little while before anyone really gets attacked or anyone attacks each other because it takes them a little while to get the proper dock that they need. I gave all the islands stone, so they all should be able to build the docks that they need, but uh, yeah, it's usually a little while. It says some villages were destroyed, but where? Who are you rooting for? And don't just say super health because they're so strong. I think I want geniuses to win because go them. Um, Ambitious would be cool. Lucky, we've seen them do really well before. Moonchild and Nightchild are really not gonna be anything special unless they get lucky and live long enough for there to be a uh, age of moon or age of whatever, age of night, age of dark. We got some alliances forming, potentially broken already. Oh, here we go. These two are allied, slow and giant. I guess they can probably relate, huh? Strong alliance, oh. It's a lot of different people trying to ally, it looks like. Shield of the people. Nice alliance. It is ambitious and short-sighted. Good for you. Holy power. It's a lot going on here. Let's go ahead and crank up the speed a little bit. Get them all to the point where they can make boats. New alliance. Eggs of people was founded. Very cool name. We managed to hit the age of wonder. Also, of everyone's dying of old age all at the same time because we placed them all at the same time. Hats off to the, whatever, 80 dead kings that we just got and all their new ones. No wars have been declared yet because they're all just trying to max out their own island population right now, but it's gonna happen. Oh, Cold Aura has declared war on Flesh Eater, Immortal on Golden Tooth, Blessed on Unlucky, Lucky has declared war on Immortal. It's going down. Look at this. Immortal's getting destroyed. Dang. Immortal should be one of the strongest ones because of obviously how good Immortal is, but if they get killed early on, whoa, Mega Heartbeat has three regions? They scooped up both of the old bomb ones. I did not expect them to be doing 
uh, anything other than dying. They're the number one kingdom right now, I think. Lustful's got two. Gluttonous has two. Uh, anyone else have two? Greedy's got two. Perfect. Wise has two. And Golden Tooth has two. Okay. It's starting to happen. Imagine Mega Heartbeat wins. That makes no sense. Kingdom Acid Blood declared war. Okay, there's a lot of wars getting declared. Let's go Sonic Speed just for a moment because it's really hard to watch at this point. I'll try to narrate from here. So Giant's gone. A lot of wars being declared. Whirlwind is destroyed. I didn't realize they were still here. How do they last that long? Veterans destroyed. Venomous is destroyed. Weak was destroyed. Agile is destroyed. Skin Burns is gone. Strong is gone. Freeze Proof is gone. Wise is gone. And we just entered into the Age of Chaos. King Slayer's gone. Mega Harpy was destroyed. Okay, let's see how this is looking. Okay, so Mega Harpy was taken over by Dragon Slayer, Crippled, and Pyromaniac. I'm really surprised Energized is still here, to be honest. You think it would only take, like, one of them to nuke the whole thing? But they did change it so it's no longer a guarantee that there's a Lightning Bolt on death. It's now a chance of Lightning Bolt. And I've seen it to be pretty low chance, so maybe they'll just get lucky and no one will actually do it. At least not for a while. Okay, Mage Slayer 130. Who's number one? Greedy's 170, Lustful 150, Gluttonous 280. Nice, Golden Tooth 180, okay. Age of Chaos. If the clouds line up just right, like this one kind of is, oh, it's gonna miss them by a little bit. It pretty much could just go down the line and just give everyone the buff. That would be pretty silly, wouldn't it? Okay, Acid Proof is gone. Acid Blood killed them. you think they would have gotten along, but you know what? Light Lamp has declared war on Energized. Bro, your, your power is literally that you just glow in the dark. And you're gonna go against the lightning boys? All right, I guess if you send a little squad over there, maybe you could, like, set them off, you know? Kingdom Gluttonous is out here declaring war on everyone. No one's been eliminated for a little while. Gluttonous is at war with Content? Oh, it's a big war. Goodness. There's a lot of people in this war, but Content is getting obliterated? By, I don't know, pyromaniacs or something? Why is it all on fire? Doesn't look good for them, tell you what. Okay, Deceitful's loading up a boat here. Kingdom Tiny was destroyed. They're dropping like flies. Mage Slayer's got three. 203 population. They're looking good. Lustful was destroyed. Dang, that could have been a good one if they lasted long enough. They didn't get eliminated so early because they get such a buff to population speed. Which I feel like is kind of what you need in here. Okay, Fast was destroyed. That was fast. <laughs> oh, brother, this guy stinks! Horrible conquest has ended. Thank goodness. I always hated that conquest. Okay, let's speed up a little bit. We still have like 60 kingdoms in here. This is impossible to watch. Moonchild is gone. Lucky was destroyed. Bummer. Energize was destroyed. Oh, did I heard the lightning strike, but their island looks fine. Okay, uh, it's going pretty quick here. Uh, slow down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Night Child is destroyed. Oh my gosh. Fertile was destroyed. Oh, Kingdom Genius was destroyed. Dang. War, bad clash has ended. Bubble Shield was destroyed. All right, we're almost going to slow it down. We're getting there. A bunch of kings just died, probably from old age. Age of Chaos is a little past halfway over. Short Sighted and Golden Tooth just got destroyed. Gluttonous over here with 350, dude. They have six islands. I think they might be in the lead. I had these off and I turned them on for a second and now they're back off again. I realized that I don't think I want random events messing this up. So if you saw a couple for a second there, they're gone again. Voices in my head was gone. Uh, Paranoid's gone. Okay, Peaceful at 180. Gluttonous at 500. We're starting to see the big names here. Uh, Greedy 170, Super Health 300, Dragon Slayer 250. Someone's gotta do something about Gluttonous. Are they in a war? Yeah, they're in a war. They got five kingdoms on their side against seven. People are teaming up against them, but they're so big now. Okay, Age of Sun just began. That's not really gonna change anything. The only thing that would really change anything is, I was gonna say Moon or Dark, but Moon Child and Night Child are both gone, so I don't think the ages really affect anything at this point. They're just visual. Blessed was destroyed. Gluttonous has taken some hits here, down from 500 down to mid 300. Fat up here at 350. I think they might be in the lead now. Oh no, Super Health 390. Dragon Slayer 400. Who's this? Peaceful with 320. Yeah, Gluttonous is getting taken down. They still have all six of their islands though, but they've just been weakened so much. Attractives hanging in there. Honest was destroyed. Cold Aura was destroyed, which puts Fat at 400-ish. Pyromaniac is in here with 480, 500 now. I think they might be in the lead just barely above Dragon Slayer. I did not expect them to do so well, but I think Pyromaniac just gives them, yeah, just gives them plus three warfare. So I guess that just makes them aggressive. Hey, we got Age of Dark. Okay, cool. Makes it a little more fun to watch. Gluttonous down to 150, but they still have all six of their islands. So they're just getting 
walloped on, but no one's taken their islands over. Deceitful was destroyed. Peaceful. They were doing a lot better a second ago, but they're still doing all right. Thorns was destroyed. Ambitious was destroyed. Gluttonous is finally getting taken over. They were the lead for a long time, but they're down to three islands, 60 population. We got Pyromaniac, 700. Super health at 370. A super amount of health, but they're not being very aggressive. Okay, Dragon Slayer's getting taken down. Pyromaniac at 700. It's funny, for all these island videos we've done, Pyromaniac has never performed as well. They're always in here, but I feel like they always get eliminated at the beginning. I've never even really thought about them beyond the intro because they never make it this far. We got Fat at 270, Dragon Slayer super spread out. Oh wait, they're only up here now. 400, Pyromaniac owns the whole corner now. Mage Slayer 250. Oh, Super Health is here and here. Interesting. Peaceful still hanging in there. Attractive still here with one island. You're lucky you guys are attractive because you're not really applying yourselves. You're not doing anything. You're just sitting there. We have like, what, 20 kingdoms? 15 kingdoms total? The War of Freedom has ended. War Sudden Conquest has ended. Pyromaniac has declared war on Greedy. They're just taking everybody out, man. No nonsense over here. Another island for them. Is anyone even close? Like, Dragon Slayer at 500 is the closest opponent. We got Super Health at 400. Okay, so there's two kingdoms around 500 and there's Pyromaniac at about a thousand now. Okay, Bomberman was destroyed. I didn't realize they were still here. Bloodlust is sitting here with 10. Greedy was destroyed. Pyromaniac declared war on Fat. That's a big kingdom versus a big kingdom. One-Eyed was destroyed. Bro. There's all these little random kingdoms that I just feel like are so non-threatening they get to last for so long. Like Pacifist is living up to their name. They have not attacked anyone and no one's attacked them. They're just sitting here at like a very low population just hanging out on their island. They got nowhere they want to go. They could scoop up some empty islands, but I feel like there won't be any more empty islands past those first few of exploded ones. Poison immunity was destroyed. Super health at 700. Pyromaniac 1300. Fat down to 70. Man. Dragon Slayer at 600. Attractive. Also just chilling here. They should be friends with the pacifists. They're just hanging out. They're just observing. 1500 pyromaniacs. They're attacking dragon slayers now. One of their main opponents, super health being the other one. Now at this point, super health has taken over so many islands that their super health trait isn't everywhere now. And it's also mixed in. So that might be a good thing or a bad thing. I'm not sure. Pacifist was destroyed. Dang. That's rude. We just entered into an age of ash. Pyromaniac is at 2,000 population. Super health at 700. Fat was destroyed. Um, we got an empty island here. Oh, taken over by... Who's this? Dragon Slayer? They were getting pushed around everywhere. They're all the way over here now. Hanging on by a thread. Victory through bread. Weightless was destroyed. How are they still here? It's funny when kingdoms get destroyed that like I didn't even notice we're even still here. Like weightless. Did they even have more than one island? I don't know, man. All right. Pyromaniac is taking on the task of defeating the super health people. I think they can do it. It's just going to take some time depending on how many people in here actually have super health and actually have full health or partly full health. Health, but I think it's pretty safe to say that the only threat Pyromaniac has to go up against is Super Health. I don't think any of these other kingdoms are going to be a problem for them. It's so interesting. Out of all these different traits that Pyromaniac did so well, just a simple plus three to warfare was enough to make them just so aggressive and so successful in war. Hang in there, acid blood. Okay, Peaceful was destroyed. They really held on for a long time, didn't they? We got a couple empty islands over here. Any takers? Come on, it looks perfectly good. They got everything you could ever want here. Oh, we're at Age of Wonders. I didn't even notice that. Doesn't really make much of a difference, but it looks nice. Attractives being destroyed. Finally, they held on for as long as they could, but uh, it's over. Age of Chaos is back. Acid Blood just got destroyed. Okay, we're down to... Oh, Super Health is down to like one and a half islands here. One island now. 50 population. Dragon Slayer's gone. And there goes Super Health, leaving just Fire Blood left? Who would have thought Fire Blood would be second place? That's so random. They just took one of their islands back. No way. Fireblood's gonna win. Fireblood's cracked. Wait a minute. They just took over another one. Okay, they're losing it now. The pyromaniacs are pissed off. How dare you take our islands. Fireblood's down to two islands left. Scratch that. Fireblood has four islands now. All right, come on, pyromaniacs. You're embarrassing yourself. You've come this far. Just finish the job. Come on now. You got this. Good for them, though, you know? Against the opposition of a kingdom literally like 30 times their size, and they actually took a few islands before going down. Respect. All right, there you go. Pyromaniacs from the bottom right corner takes the win. All for fish, they say. So true. GG's. A lot of surprises today, I feel like. 
Some of the kingdoms that I thought would go quickly didn't, and some of the ones I thought would do really well didn't. And uh, the one thing that was guaranteed was that Death Nuke was going to blow up and take a lot of people with them, and they did just that. So bless them. And uh, yeah, Pyromaniac takes the W. Congratulations. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't yet, and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>